Okay, so basically what I did, we made some white sauce for today with ricotta cheese. This normally is the red sauce on top. Now the red sauce inside with the shrimps, buffalo shrimp, and the white sauce is on the outside. That's usually the ricotta cheese on the inside. And this is the dish for today. Buffalo shrimp manicotti. And here's the sauce. I'm going to add another spoon of this sauce. I added like two spoons in here, but I've already used up some of the sauce. See? One tablespoon. I'm going to add garlic powder. You add as much or as little as you think that your family likes. Oh, went a little overboard there, but it's okay. They love it here. I have the flame on low. Medium low, and now I'm adding flakes, crushed flakes, pepper flakes, crushed red pepper, a little oregano, not too much, just a little, and I'm going to add some cheese in here. See, you leave that in there for about five minutes, and this makes a nice white sauce for your spaghetti, your pasta, whatever you're in the mood for. And now I'm just adding some Monterey Jack cheese. This sauce is so nice and creamy and it is delicious, oh my god. Just add these ingredients that I'm telling you. The garlic powder, the red pepper flakes, the oregano, the Monterey Jack cheese, and a little salt. Not too much salt because the cheese already has salt. Sorry about the lighting in here. I always tell you guys I have horrible lighting but I have great food. Just a little bit, not too much. And you stir it, let that cheese melt in there. You see how nice and thick the sauce is becoming? You see that? And when it gets nice and cheesy, you put it over your manicotti, your, 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 your shells, any other shells that you're using, your spaghetti, whatever you're in the mood for, like I said. This sauce tastes delicious. See, I'm just waiting for the cheese to melt. I forgot to mention, I also added a, a, a half a cup of milk in here. I didn't want to leave that out. In case anyone's interested in making the sauce, so you can see this sauce, like I said again, is delicious. Just waiting a few more minutes. So the sauce is just about ready, right? Look at it. Look at this deliciousness. See how it thickened up a little, especially with the cheese? In the comment section, in the description area, I'm going to leave how I made the sauce. You have got to make this. If you're interested in trying it out, I'm going to leave the uh, directions down there on how I made the sauce. I'm just going to add a little bit more. And remember, these are stuffed with shrimp, buffalo shrimp. Sorry about that. And then at the end, I just like to add crushed flakes on top. You can add whatever you like. You can add avocado. You can add whatever you like, anything. Onions, peppers, pico de gallo. It's up to you. Go ahead and try making it. Go ahead. I'm going to give you the uh, instructions down below in the description area so you guys can give it a try and you let me know how it turned out and if you're new to my channel please don't forget to subscribe comment and share so we can continue doing videos together love you guys have a blessed day okay i'm just so happy about how the plate came out how it looks the buffalo shrimp manicotti and i love it and so i just had to show it one more time okay guys bye bye now